what's going on guys, Craig Green and then here I'm back with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to drive any destroyed vehicle, like any blown up vehicle or any wrecked vehicle that's been destroyed with a sticky bomb after the patch 1.33. This is only working for next generation consoles only guys, but before we get into the video, can we smash like, uh, I don't know, uh, 10 likes on this video, it will mean a lot, and subscribe if you are new to the channel so you don't miss any content that I post. And if you're an Android or iOS device, make sure you hit the little bell on my channel. So you don't, so you can get notified whenever I post any new GTA 5 content. But anyway, guys, let's get straight into today's video. So the first thing you need to, do, guys, will need to have a friend in the session with you that has a VIP, or if you're a VIP yourself, and you just need two people for this, and you will need to be a part of an organisation. And you want to head to the airport or any location that has a parked car that you can smash the glass on. And once you smash the glass, you want to be uh, walk for the passenger side door. And as soon as you get in the vehicle, you want to tell your friend to blow the car up. And you should notice that you'll be stuck in the car and you won't get launched out or anything like that and you'll be able to drive the vehicle. Um, but the only downside to this is your car will stop after uh, a couple of seconds, maybe a minute or so. So make sure you last this as long as you can. Um, but it's pretty easy guys. All you need to do is you will need to have a friend, chug a sticky bomb on the car and basically blow it up as soon as you're in the passenger side uh, door and as soon as you start in the vehicle it should explode. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you do leave a like on it and subscribe if you are new to the channel. But with all that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and have a good day. Peace.